everyone welcome to my channel let's talk about it media 21 please like comment and subscribe and please hit the notification bell that way every time i upload a video you will be the first one to see it no all comments are alleged in our opinion and for entertainment purposes only where we discuss celebrity news celebrity gossip what's going on on ig and google and what's the hot topic for the day or the week fair use Copyright disclaimer under Section 107 of the Copyright Act of 1976, allowances made for fair use for purposes such as criticism, comma, comments, comma, news reporting, comma, teaching, comma, scholarships, and research. Fair use is use permitted by a copyright statute that might otherwise be infringing. All comments are alleged, in our opinion, and for entertainment purposes only. Thanks for tuning in. Thanks for supporting the channel. Don't forget to like, to comment. But be kind and also turn on the notification bell. That way, every time I upload a video, you'll be the first one to see it. So let's get into it. It's being talked about that they don't make any symbols. I'll have to say it that way, like that. I don't know any present. So right now, Kim is allegedly getting dragged by The View. And allegedly, it's not alleged, the... Uh, people that were in the audience actually gave a boo because they were saying, well, I when Whoopi Goldberg was basically saying she can't think of any at the present time. And then I think one of the girls on the panel said, well, what about Kim Kardashian? And the crowd booed. They were like, ooh, no, boo. And then she was like, okay, I'm not even going to go there. And she's like, let's move on. I'm going to let you listen to the clip. I know this is going to sting. As far as for Kim, the shift is happening. The relevancy is happening. I think the team, I think her team is really messing up her brand, her. She's somewhat turning into a mean girl. We see how she treats Courtney. We see how she was treating Chloe. And it's like people allegedly have to do what she wants them to do. And basically everything allegedly has to be formed around her, about her, to help her. And it's like everybody's kind of getting sick of it to where it's like we see allegedly that she's ups allegedly obsessed with media and she wants to be in everybody's faces. And sometimes you have to make people miss you. And I don't think she gets that. We see that there's concerns about relationship. We see that the ex-boyfriends get dragged. We see that the ex-boyfriends become a storyline and people are just feeling like um, an icon, a beautiful woman. Uh, a gorgeous woman, a voluptuous woman is something that is respected. And I don't think as role models, I don't think they're role models. I don't think they're really respected in the industry. I'll let you listen in on what was said and then we'll go, go from there. Just hold on one second. Just waiting for the audio. But yeah, I, I was shocked because I had heard about it, but I didn't think that people were doing that. You know, so yeah. So they're talking about Raquel Welch, unfortunately passed away. And then you'll hear what Whoopi had to say. And then you'll hear what the panel had to say. Yeah, oh, she was. for those of you who are not aware, she passed yesterday. Yeah, yeah. 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 So sail on Raquel. They don't they make that, that you know, poster that we're seeing right yeah. now, remember? You know, they don't make any sex symbols like that. I don't know any... Uh, well, Kim Kardashian is. No. 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 Kardashian. No. No. <laughs> turning. 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 It's turning. Yeah, well, turning. You all are hard. That, yeah, that's not even... You can't even put them in the... I'm not even... Look, I'm going... I'm moving on. <laughs> it was so heartbroken. Yeah, so the the panel spoke. The audience spoke. And I think that th that's going to sting. She really wants to be well known as one of America's most beautiful. And there's other women that are gorgeous, that are beautiful. There's actresses, there's models, there's people that are decent and good people. And they stand our morals. I think where the shift happened, a lot has to do with the tape. A lot has to do with the playboy. A lot has to do with how we see the children are being raised. You know, I think a lot of people were kind of really side eyeing in regards to wanting to post anything is when, and everybody talks about it, 
is when she allowed North to be on Pete's lap. And it's like, you know, the father of the child's not going to like that. A father will put their daughter on their lap. And at a certain age, they even stop doing it. So to put your nine-year-old daughter on a man's lap that you're dating, people side-eyed it. And it's like, that could have been a family moment. It didn't have to be posted. And everybody was like, well, who did that come from? Who did they send that to? And, and there was a dragation. There's a dragation about the Balenciaga thing. She was basically saying, oh, why well, wasn't in the ad. Being in the ad doesn't mean that you have to be in the ad. But if you were supporting them and a model for them, if you didn't know what they stood for, people are side eyeing her and the situation. And you got to go deeper in regards to the whole Balenciaga thing. It's deeper than what many people think. If you listen to the videos that were going on on TikTok, on YouTube, people did a deep dive of what those symbols and issues were. And that's the bigger issue that people don't get. And it's a problem. It's a problem in the industry trying to bring people into their foolishness of what they want us to think that's okay. And that's not okay. But well, well wishes. I know this is going to sting. And then remember there was a Super Bowl. She went to the Super Bowl. and Not the Super Bowl. She went to a football game. And people were booing her then when they, they scanned the camera on her. So, um, and then people were calling her out where the kids were about to take a picture with the football player. And you should see how the football player looked like, oh, she wants to get in the picture. And he seemed happy, smile on his face as soon as he was going to take a picture with the kids. But as soon as Kim, she, Kim ran over there to get behind everybody, always seeking media attention, always seeking a moment, always seeking to allegedly manipulate the media. And also the K's and the J's like to do stuff for people to sell their items and products. And people are getting sick of that. It just recently happened. It just recently happened. They allegedly came out with something new, seeking media attention. They came out with something two weeks ago, seeking media attention. And it's everybody's kind of like, they're tired of it. They're tired. And then they kind of connect their name to a person to sell a product. People are sick of that. People are sick of it. And it's like, they could have been well-known, well-respected. And then the royal thing, everybody's like, they are not United States, America's royal family. They're not. A royal family is respected, kind, loving, do a lot of great things for the community. Even Kanye dragged that they like to do stuff for media attention they, when they trying to help the community, they're doing stuff to help get media attention. You know, he was basically saying, you know, the, the mom, mother's teacher daughter's different. Teacher daughter's different. So we're watching unhealthy relationships. We're watching unhealthy situations. We look at the Scott situation, him drinking. We look at the Kanye situation in regards to the controversy. We look at the Tristan situation in regards to the cheating. We look at the Travis Scott situation in regards to Astro World. I can go on and on about situations. We all know it. We all see it. And it's like mothers need to teach their daughters different so they can be in a healthy relationship. It's almost like she used to show her situation when she was married to Bruce. Bruce transitioned to Caitlyn. And then after that, her relationship with Corey is kind of hush-hush. She puts her daughters in the forefront to hold down the fort. But this is a business for Kim. Taking pictures, getting media attention, getting paid for that. She's put her daughters in a situation where they're in the forefront. Also, when Ray J called out and said that he didn't obtain and that their signature on a contract to sell the tape and that there was an additional several tapes and that the mom allegedly looked at or viewed and you know, Ray J allegedly showed the signatures. He showed what transpired. He kept a 20 to 25 year secret. Many people were like, wow, they saw the emails. Oh, we didn't make you look bad, but then they really made him look bad. It's a sad situation because you want to look and wish well for people, but they have to do better in being good people. And, and being good role models is sad because deep down inside, they're pushed to do media Every week they have to come up and figure out what they're going to do and show the world. And then there's this TV show 
ratings for E! was going down. We really don't know what the Hulu numbers are. But then, of course, they were asking fans what they want to see because it's the same old, same old. You guys dragging your exes, bad relationships, this, that. You want to show us what that event was. We already seen it on Instagram. We already saw it on Facebook. So, what wishes? I know she is going to feel away. I'll play it again just so you can kind of hear what they said. But, well wishes. And it, and she moved on. Thanks for tuning in. Thanks for supporting the channel. Like, comment, and subscribe, everyone. Have a great day.